Here's how you can use chat GPT and AI to uh, analyze historic political cartoons. Remember, there is a difference between cheating and utilizing AI for a, uh, as a tool. Uh, uh, we're going to start off with uh, this political cartoon right here. And um, I'm a little familiar with uh, some of the writing here, so I'm just going to write in the section here. I'm going to put analyze a cartoon with three people. Now, I'm not giving any specific. Notice I spelled cartoon wrong. I'll probably spell a couple others uh, incorrectly as well. Three uh, political, but three people. Uh, two are men and one could be a man or woman, I guess, depending on your interpretation of gender. And one could be a man or woman. But the person is wearing a dress labeled Congress. I think it says Congress, right? Yeah. One man has one man has a bag with New Deal remedies. Not what it says there. New Deal remedies. Um and then we'll put a sickly man is sitting down near bottles labeled uh, was it TVA, AAA, WPA, and so on. All right, so let's look at these results here. Two men likely represent average citizens or taxpayers. So it's kind of getting that wrong because this is uh, Uncle Sam. Third individual wearing a dress label. So, no, that's actually FDR. I actually could have gave give it the uh, information. It does say FDR on it. So it didn't get that, that particular information accurate, but it's still making it yes. It symbolizes the legislative branch. It was labeled as Congress. It appears to be a symbolic representation of the challenges of the time with a focus on the impact of New Deal policies. Okay. Uh, hasn't mentioned anything about the Depression. Seems to be, you know, okay right now. The man carrying a bag label remedies represents the government or Roosevelt. So it did now pick up that we're talking about Roosevelt in the cartoon, even though I didn't really mention it. He introduced New Deal policies, which he did. The bag symbolized the New Deal programs aimed at addressing the economic hardships. So that's accurate. The man sitting down uh, represents an individual or group affected by the economic crisis. It is Uncle Sam, so it didn't quite pick that up. I wonder if it would. I'll ask it some more questions. And it does, the, they, the bottles do represent New Deal programs. It's looking at the effectiveness or impact of New Deal policies. I would say that is accurate holds the power to implement these policies. It seems that the two men are dissatisfied or unimpressed with the results. Uh, the man surrounded by bottles suggests that despite the men, you know, so this right here is a little bit questionable. And, um, you know, we could possibly ask it some additional questions. Uh, we could say, uh, oh, it does say US on the slipper. The man sitting down has slippers titled U.S. The man with bag has a FDR hat. And now it seems to have picked up more information regarding the man. He's no longer a citizen. He did pick up that it is uh, the uh, United States in general. So I would say this actually is a, is a good start for understanding that political cartoon. It actually is giving giving away a lot. Uh, let's take a look at this one here. Um, okay, a second cartoon has a man uh, with a rope to several boats in the Caribbean and uh, titled 
notice the spelling, you know, it does pick up on it. Big stick in the Caribbean Sea. Okay. You know, big stick in the Caribbean Sea. It's identified the man as Roosevelt. Right here. It has the year. The man represents the United States, actually represents uh, Roosevelt. Sure, our focus of the cartoon. I would say this is accurate. Probably not too important, though. Well, this definitely was Roosevelt's foreign policy. This was, uh, I guess, a summary, like a, a slogan to convey with that. What's about? And it's picking up that this is uh, about the United States right here, uh, exerting a significant influence of control over various nations in the Caribbean. Connectable symbolizes the idea that the U.S. is maintaining control dominance over these regions through economic, political, and military means. So right there, just identified imperialism. Uh, could be a commentary on American expansion of American imperialism. So it does pick up on it. So this definitely seems to be a way to check your work when you're looking at political cartoons.